This Hello and welcome to the tale of my life. Today I'm here to tell you the tale of my life from baby to currently. Yes, I am whatever I am a whatever the hell you are. I am a that. <laughs> Sorry guys. There's like this time where I'm always in a call with Brian and then no one hears him and then everyone feels bad for him in the ending and if you don't you're a very bad person because he wishes to give you my videos. But don't worry. I will find a way. Um, okay, back to the tale of my life. So, um, I was born July 2nd, no telling. And my parents named us No Telling and No Telling. Censored video. So, um, it wasn't just me who was bo born. There was also a baby brother. Or an older brother, because I was the baby sister. Because he was born a second before me. So anyway, I'm um, going on. They named us No Telling and No Telling. Anyway, so in the hospital room, a tale, my brother peed on me. He peed on me the second we were born. He was like, and I failed my PKU test. I don't remember what the PKU test is. I think it was the blood test because I have this weird blood, Mediterranean blood that no one else in my family has. It's really awkward, but it's okay. <laughs> We don't know what happened. I may have been switched at birth. <laughs> and I'm really starting to think that now because of my sister. <laughs> Keep thumbs up that that might be true. But I do love my family. Sadly, blood tests have proved that they are actually my family. So, thumbs down for that, you know? But don't dislike the video unless you don't like me. And then I guess. I guess I'll just sit in my room crying while Brad's like sitting here like, SHUT UP! <laughs> so, um, um, so yeah, my brother peed on me. <laughs> um, another story I remember is, um, one story was we had the whole entire basement as a playroom. And he would steal my pacifiers, and I would steal his diapers. I mean, I guess that is pretty normal, isn't it? <laughs> um, put it down in the comments if you think stealing diapers and <laughs> pacifiers are normal. <laughs> um, we had these two, like, yellow and red car beds. One night, I went into his room. I was probably around two, three. This is like one of the weirdest memories I have. It's like one of the only memories I have from a childhood, a child younger than three, I guess. I don't know. Weird, right? Okay, so um, I, I, I kicked him out of his bed. I literally went into his room. I threw him off his bed. <laughs> I slipped in his bed because his mattress was comfier. <laughs> At two and three, car bed, or is it, I don't know, it was at least five, I was at least younger than five, anyway, I don't know, do you expect me just to know my age, and, uh, derpy wolves, um, so, yeah, that, that's one of the memories, and then he pushed me out, and then we fell asleep in the bed together. <laughs> um, I guess that's how it works. Anyway, um, we went to Disney World one time. It actually was the last time I ever went to Disney World. And I was probably around turning eight, I think. Maybe. Because, you know, back then, back in my day, when I was a little feeling. <laughs> Back in my day when I was a little feely. Uh, you, if it was your birthday, you used to get into Disney World for free, folks. <laughs> so, this was maybe about a couple years ago. I don't know.
maybe. Uh, derp. Anyway, um, so, so one time there was a parade and we were standing, like, if you've ever been to Disney World and you remember the parade area, um, there's these poles. We climbed the pole and the ice cream guy that was selling ice cream said, if you get down from the pole, we will all give you, I will give your whole entire family free ice cream. Do you know what we did? We climbed down. <laughs> it was free ice cream. And then we pushed away to the front of the crowd. <laughs> so, um, then we, then we got free ice cream. Um, it's not, see, we're not even, I don't remember a lot. Um, skipping that part because it's not important. Oh, uh, yeah. I just finally learned how to ride a bike. <laughs> Yay, me! <laughs> Um, <laughs> um, I guess I have a very nice life. I guess it's a very nice life. Yeah, it's so lifey. Yeah. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell me if you want me to get more into the details because apparently this one sucked. Like, comment, subscribe. Oh, wait, I just said that. Bye bye, Discord. Bye bye, ponies. Bye bye, fellow citizens. Bye bye, Brian. I don't want to speak to you anymore after what you did earlier. <laughs> I'll put down in the description what he did earlier. I really will. And everyone will see how I feel. <laughs> Enjoy your lives. I hope it was better than mine. Well, actually, my life isn't complete light. Yeah, unless tomorrow I'll get hit by a bus. And then again, and then I... <laughs> or, um, or, um, I jump, I jump, I, I fall off the lighthouse. So, um, I must sit in my very fancy chair to say a, f a good to a goodbye. And I would say bronies for the win. I need a catchphrase. Anyone who has an idea for a catchphrase, put it down in the video. So, um, I'll link the video, but there, there's a guy who made a video for me. He made me smile. I'll, I'll post it for you. Don't see it. It's a very nice video. <laughs> Thank you guys for being loyal to the. I need a team name. I'm so not collected. Bye bye.